So this is how I prepare the dryad saddle mushroom. As you can see, I've cut it away just on the outer skirt. This is where it tends to be fresher. I've washed it gently. Now on the back, I'm gonna remove the spores. So I've started by using a child's knife, which isn't too sharp, just to lift back the edge of the spores here, as you can see. Once it's lifted, you should better then just better peel the spores away, like so. It's a good indication of how fresh they are as to how well they peel. So this is a good one because they're coming off nicely. And as you can see, it leaves all that lovely flesh behind. So let's just leave that there for a minute. So now all I would do is just remove the outer section. Again, this is all personal choice. It's just the way I prepare them. Using a nice sharp knife, it should slide nicely through the flesh. If you come across any resistance, that's where the mushroom is going to be tougher. And again, personal choice whether to eat it. You can then dice it, slice it into whatever shape you want, depending on what you're using. These pieces are going into a curry. And you can see some pieces here earlier I'll be using for a stir fry.